Okay, in this video we're going to do part uh, D of this velocity versus speed exercise. Okay, so let's take a look at the question. The question says, if the girl covered the first half lap in 28.8 seconds, what were her average velocity for that half lap? Okay, notice that questions C and D sound the same. The only difference is that question C is the average speed and for question D we're looking for average velocity. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's solve this problem. Alright, so this is the first thing you should have uh, done. You should have drawn the picture and you should have written the formula. So average velocity is the change in displacement. Okay, so the girl is going to cover half the lap. Okay, so if you remember from part C, okay, we said that half the lap is this distance right here, correct? This was the distance of half the lap. And that is where a lot of students tend to get confused and stuck. Um, again, we're not looking for distance, okay, so we are not looking for this, okay? We are looking for displacement. So if this is where she started, if she started at this point right here, and she ended at this point right here, remember that displacement is the shortest distance between two points. So uh, the displacement is actually the distance between these two points right here, this distance right here, not this one, okay? This one, this one right here is for speed, okay? This one is when you're looking for speed because this is a distance but this one right here is for uh, velocity, okay? So this is the one you use for velocity because this is the displacement, or in other words, the shortest distance between two points. Okay, so let's try to solve this problem. So average velocity is the change in displacement, okay? So uh, x final minus x initial over uh, t final minus t initial. Okay, so the initial position is zero because she started at zero. And the final position is right here, okay? So the final position, this distance, is the diameter. The diameter of the circle we know is 40 meters. So the final distance is 40. And the, uh, the time, the change in time, is 28.85 seconds. So 28.85 seconds. That's the change in time. Let me see. Oh, sorry, 28.8 seconds. 28.8 seconds. 28.8 seconds. Okay, so this is 40 divided by 28.8. Let's see what that is. So 40 divided by 28.8. No. 28. That gives us 1.38 and I'll round to 1.39. So the average velocity is 1.39 meters per second, okay? Uh, notice that the average velocity is different from the average speed which we found in this problem, okay? So for part C, the average speed was 2.18 meters per second, and for part D, the average speed is 1.39 meters per second. So I, I hope these videos uh, helped you figure out the difference between uh, the, the average velocity and the average speed. Okay, remember that average velocity deals with displacement and displacement is the shortest distance between two points, whereas average speed is the total distance. Okay, so thank you for watching the videos.